there. Stop pretending you can't. What you go and do that for? Mm -hmm. Oh yes, I remember. Some clod turned me into a tree. You were just breaking the spell, weren't you? Thank you. The name's Bog. I was pushed out of the cave. Told not to come back. Not ever. Then I ended up as a tree. <laughs> Lucky you came along, really. Oh, what a shame. When they threw me out of the cave, they took everything I owned. And so this is all I have to express my thanks. I hope you can forgive me. Or, well, if you can afford to wait for a while, I could sneak back into the cave and bring back something of actual value. Then I'd be of some real use to you, I reckon. Right. But I'll need a moment. I'm, I'm frightened of them. So I have to gather myself. My knees start knocking, just thinking about that god-awful cave on the shore. made you go and do a thing like that? My mum was a seamstress, and that sewing kit was all I had to remember her by. I always wanted to be just like sweet old mum. Then I s suppose I, I can't just curl up and die, can I? Thank you. You're very kind. I always wanted to be a seamstress like, like my mum. sewing needle. Please, master, allow me to serve you as your seamster. I can't make nothing from scratch, but I'm happy to make adjustments to your garments. 
the seamster at your service. Ready to make adjustments. Master, I was wondering, do you ever make adjustments to your garb yourself? I would, well, rather you let me do the job when possible, please. I don't ask anything in return, you know, and, well, I am your personal seamster after all. Dock the seamster at your service, master. Ready to make adjustments to your garments. Master, my apologies. Your wardrobe includes the garb of the old demigods, and I'm afraid I can't make adjustments to them. <laughs> my mum told me once that a royal seamster would do them up in a jiffy. Just wait, master. Before long, I'll be that good too. Is that a gift for my undeserving self? Thank you kindly. But what on earth could it... Oh, what amazing. I've never seen a golden needle. Not in all my life. With a spectacular royal crest to boot. Are you certain that this is for me? Oh, I can hardly believe it. Have faith in me, Master. I'll polish my craft enough that I deserve this golden gift. I'll be the golden seamster, Bok. Now I'll be able to sew anything. Even the threads of the demigods. Do you think that Mum would be pleased if she knew that I'm as good as any royal seamster now? Oh, it's still not enough. I need to learn how to sew from scratch like her. the seamster at your service, master. Ready to make adjustments to your garments. Master, may I ask you something? Would you mind if I called you Lord? I heard that you and the other tarnished seek the throne of the Elden Lord. Well, I know that you will be the one, and you would make just the manner of kind-hearted Lord that I would wish for. So please, if you would, allow me to call you Lord. You don't say. Thank you. Thank you. My Lord. My Lord. My Lord. Please become Elden Lord. And please let I, Bok the Seamster, remain at your side. The seamster at your service, my lord. Ready to make adjustments to your garments. My lord, have you ever wished you might be born again? Well, they say that Renala of Rhea Lucaria has the power to help people be reborn. Oh, me? Reborn? 
bore. Oh, look at me. When you're this ugly, well, being reborn, it would hardly make a difference, I'm afraid. My lord, did you see it? The, the herb tree. I, oh, I don't really have the words for this. I was so, so dazzled. I felt something stir in my breast. The herd tree is waiting for you, my lord. I know it, I do. I feel it in my bones. Oh, please, take the throne of Elden Lord. M my lord, what's this? Oh, oh, oh. These are precious. Are you certain that it's for me? Oh. Oh. My lord. How did you know? It was my only wish that I might honor you with a decent appearance. My lord. It shouldn't take me long. I'm off to see Ranala of Rhea Lucaria. I'll be reborn, fresh and new. <laughs>